Hi guys, um, my name is Midi. Um, welcome. I've decided to do these um, lockdown diary videos just to talk about what I'm going through, what I'm seeing, what I'm feeling. Um, I think I will release them every other day. Um, made them, maybe make them into a series, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Um, but I'll try and do different things in different days and shoot them in different locations, different places. So it's not always going to be as smooth. Um, yeah, so guys, I just want to talk about how I'm feeling regarding lockdown. Well, not necessarily lockdown, but how I'm feeling as a videographer and photographer who owns their own business, who is heavy, heavily reliant on customers that are that hold events, that have like dance schools, um, parties, um, brunches, fly out, you know, travel groups and stuff, um, press trips, and none of that can happen because that means gathering people, traveling, and none of that is allowed. So now I have to be at home, I have to now do different things. So now I am running around trying to figure out, well not running around, but in my head, like my head's going at 100 miles an hour, just trying to figure out how to navigate this space, how to deal with it. And I'm saying to myself, this is where we are, but now we need a solution, so we move. But I guess some people will be like, no, but you need to go through the motions, you need to deal with it. And I'm like, I've already dealt with it in the sense that it's whatever, yeah, it's it's whatever. Just, yeah, um, or we move, but we move, we really do move. Um, and I feel like that's that's where I'm at. I've, I've moved, but um, I don't know whether I'm just running away from actually thinking about it. But I don't think so because I generally take time to think about things, and sometimes I process things even when I am doing other things, um, whilst I'm editing, whilst I'm chilling, whilst I'm walking. Do you know what I mean? Um, and I think this is where we are. It's just like if you have a tire punch and you don't have a tire to replace it. This is where you are. There's no point in being like, oh, so let's see what made the tire do this. No, we've got a tire puncher. We don't have an extra tire. So we need to either call RAC or can we get someone who's got more likely the same car to kind of help us who can have a put, put a replacement tire. So I think that's how I generally move. Um, but obviously certain, certain other things you have to be, I oh, hope that's a work email. Um, other things and certain things you have to obviously take time and do with them. But I'm going to try and release these videos every other day. I'm going to try and have more conversations with my friends and people that I know. Um, I'm going to try and do some behind the scenes, maybe shoot a couple of things, maybe do some behind the scenes. Not promising though, but we'll see. Um, and yeah, guys, cheers. That's some green tea. Don't normally drink green tea, but yeah, like, thanks for watching and being here till the end, if you made it. <laughs> Appreciate that. Um, but I'll leave this with you guys. Okay, it sounded like, you know, nah, nah, nah. But um, guys, just take care of your mental space um, and do what you want to do and how you want to do it. Do you know what I mean? Like sometimes, sometimes we get so caught up with social media. Sorry, I'm going back into it now. I was saying bye. But social media kind of puts pressures on us. Sometimes you need to take a break, take a break. If you need to talk to someone to kind of reassure you that bro, you're on the same trip, sis, you're doing the right thing or sis, you might need to do this here and there. Have that circle of friends that tells you the truth and that are there for you like that. Um, and I'm blessed and, and fortunate enough to have a lot of those. <laughs> um, but also you have to cultivate the same friendship towards them. So it's a two-way street. Um, and how you maintain that is sometimes people are going through things and they don't shout you, but you just have to be persistent. And then that's when sometimes they realize like, yo, this person's been there, like they're, they're actually looking for a man like that. And then they start also, oh, that brought me accident, wow. Um, but yeah, anyway, guys, thank you very much for, for listening. Um, I'll see you in the next video, probably in the next two, maybe three days. Um, and we'll talk about something else. Maybe we're in a, we'll be in a different location. Maybe we'll be shooting, but um, let's just see where we go. Thank you very much, guys, for being here.